The monastery of Saint Macarius the Great also known as Deir Abba Makar is a Coptic Orthodox monastery located in Wadi El Natran, Bahira Governorate, about 92 km northwest of Cairo, and off the highway between Cairo and Alexandria. The monastery was founded in approximately 360 AD by Saint Macarius of Egypt, who was the spiritual father to more than 4,000 monks of different nationalities. The monastery has been continuously inhabited by monks since its 4th century founding. Several Christian saints and fathers of the early church were monks at the monastery of Saint Macarius, including Saint Macarius of Alexandria, Saint John the Dwarf, Saint Paphnutius the Ascetic, Saint Isidore, Saint Arsenius, Saint Moses the Black, Saint Poamang, Saint Serapion among others. In 1969, the monastery entered an era of restoration, both spiritually and architecturally, with the arrival of 12 monks under the spiritual leadership of Father Mata El Meskin. These monks had spent the previous 10 years living together entirely isolated from the world. In the desert caves of Wadi El Rayyan, about 50 kilometers south of Fayum, Pope Cyril VI ordered this group of monks to leave Wadi El Rayyan and go to the monastery of Saint. Macarius the Great to restore it. At that time only six aged monks were living in the monastery. And its historic buildings were on the verge of collapsing. The new monks were received by the abbot of the monastery, Bishop Michael, Metropolitan of Asiat, under Pope Shenoda III, who was himself busily engaged in restoring the monastery of St. Pishor and the Paromios Monastery and after 14 years of constant activity both in reconstruction and spiritual renewal. The monastic community in the monastery of St. Macarius numbers about 100 monks. The monastery of St. Macarius maintains spiritual, academic and fraternal links with several monasteries abroad, including the monastery of Chouetoin in Belgium, Solzmies Abbey and the monastery of the Transfiguration in France, both monastic community in Italy. Dear El Half in Lebanon, and the Convent of the Incarnation in England. The Monastery of St. Macarius the Great contains the relics of many saints, such as the 49 Martyrs of Cetus. During the restoration of the big church of St. Macarius, the crypt of St. John the Baptist and that of Elisha the Prophet were discovered below the northern wall of the church. In accordance with the site mentioned in manuscripts from the 11th and 16th centuries found in the library of the monastery, this is also confirmed by the ecclesiastical tradition of the Coptic Orthodox Church. The relics were gathered in a special reliquary and placed before the sanctuary of St. John the Baptist in the Church of St. Macarius. A detailed account of this discovery and an assessment of the authenticity of the relics was published by the monastery. This table is a listing of the popes of the Coptic Orthodox Church that were from the monastery of St. Macarius or that spent long periods in it. As of 2013, Emba Epiphanius, who had been a member of the Brotherhood since 1984, was appointed as the bishop and abbot of the monastery of St. Macarius. He was 64 years old when he died in 2018. The Coptic Church published a statement to say that Pope Dervardros, mourned in Emba Epiphanius, a true monk whose life was steeped in meekness and humbleness, also a scholar who possessed a wealth of knowledge that fruit research and publications in various branches of ecclesiastical studies. The Pope prayed for peace for his soul and comfort for the Saint Macarius monk assembly as well as all who loved the late abbot. He was simple in his clothes, his house and his food. Bishop Epiphanius was very simple and he preferred to sit in the last rows. Pope Tavadros would also consult the abbot due to his extensive knowledge and authorship. The abbot had attended 20 conferences in five years with the Pope's blessing. Emba Epiphanius was an ardent follower of Matthew the Poor and it is believed that this led to severe tension within his monastery particularly where the former monk and suspect in the abbot's killing, Will Sar Tavadros, was concerned. Forty days after his death, a retreat house was inaugurated by Pope Tavadros II himself, bearing the name of Amba Epiphanius Retreat House, which welcomes foreign pilgrims from all around the world, coordinates, 
30 degrees 17 minutes 29 seconds north 30 degrees 28 minutes 34 seconds east 30.29139 degrees north 30.47611 degrees east 30.29139 30.47611